Back during E3, the US got a special edition gold PS4 Slim with one terabyte hard drive, which no one else got at the time. But now, in Europe, they have that and a silver PS4 Slim, which only comes with a 500 gig hard drive, but also two controllers. Now, this is currently only in Europe. I actually had to order this off Amazon UK to import it, which it said it didn't ship to the US, but here it is, so. As per usual, we have a second box inside that's just plain and white. This is actually a slightly different thing than I usually get with the US ones. It actually says PS4 on the box and it opens differently. Here it's a side flap, so let's... This one comes with two controllers. Let's open them up. Yeah, this is actually a lot like the gold one too, where it's got the silver reflective as like the main body but on the back, it's still that kind of just matte plastic look. One thing that is different though, is the fact that different power cable, because obviously this was designed for the UK. Thankfully, since this is a system that works with voltages across you know, the entire world, we can just plug in a cable that we have for one of our PS4s and work just fine. Maybe you mentioned if you're not crazy and don't have a ton of PS4s, you can just go on Amazon and buy it. As a clarification, if you're not crazy like us and own a ton of PS4s, you can just buy one of these cables by themselves for a pretty cheap price, so. And then we have, of course, the main reason we're opening this thing up. And that's information about how to protect your PS4. Oh, that's actually really pretty. It definitely has a really strong sheen to it like the gold one did, but it doesn't bother me quite as much with the silver. To be honest too, I've actually always had a thing for silver systems. I loved the Platinum GameCube and the silver PS2. And I was kind of worried that maybe that wasn't true anymore because I haven't had a system in silver since then, but looking at this one, I actually do really like this. If you didn't know that this is imported, you wouldn't be able to tell otherwise. I mean, everything is the same. Ports, buttons. So let's take a closer look at this thing. Now, while this is the first Slim that's in silver, this isn't actually the first silver PS4. In Japan, there was actually a limited edition Dragon Quest Warriors PS4 that had a little like slime design on it. And here, we also got a Batman Arkham Knight edition that had a little outline of Batman on it. But those were both original PS4s and they had some kind of decal or design. This is the first just straight silver design. And as I said earlier, it's a slim one. And I gotta say, I really like the way this one looks. I touched on this a little bit during the unboxing, but I've always been a huge fan of silver systems, and it's not really a color style we've gotten a lot with more recent systems, especially ones that are just plain silver and not having extra little designs and stuff on them. Like the gold one, I really like the fact that it has this black trim which offsets a bit of the flashiness of the sheen on this thing, which once again can definitely blind you in the right light. Now this is currently exclusive to just Europe. There is no word yet if it's coming to the US, but that was also the situation with the Glacier White PS4, which we did eventually get here, it just kind of had a silent release. So there is still hope for you, but if you're impatient and you just want to import one of these like I did, it's really not that big of a deal. I mean, physically, once again, this is the same thing as a PS4 here. The only difference is the power cable you get. You don't have to worry about things like voltage differences. You don't have to buy a converter. All you have to do is get a different power cable so it works with the wall unit here and it'll run just fine. There's also no region locking for games on the PS4. The only time it's ever an issue is if you own a physical disc from a different region than your PSN account. So as long as you're using a US PSN account and you're buying games here, everything's gonna run perfectly fine. The only time region locking is an issue that is a bit of a downer is if you like watching Blu-ray movies on your PS4, this will not support Blu-rays released in the US. So if you like using it as your media device, that might be a reason to pause. But otherwise, Netflix, Hulu, all that stuff, still gonna work just the same. And if you're worried about price, that actually isn't really an issue either. This is listed on the UK Amazon site as 249 pounds, but when you ring up for international shipping, it actually drops it down to 203, which in US currency is basically 260 bucks. So it's actually cheaper than a PS4 Slim here, which goes for 300. It is only a 500 gig hard drive, but you're getting two controllers. A controller by itself is 60 bucks. So. It's actually a really good deal, and it's not that hard to switch out the hard drive if you want to upgrade later. So there you have it, the silver PS4 Slim. Now, if you're actually including all the colors that have been released, this is the fourth color for the PS4 Slim, five if you include special edition systems, so it might be time to rank them.